Imagine if tomorrow morning your car gets fully charged in just three minutes, and that too, without lithium. Yes, Elon Musk has surprised the world once again. Now, Tesla is going to say bye-bye to lithium in the future and can replace it with aluminum-ion battery technology. And the biggest thing, it is cheap and fast too. This new battery technology coming from Tesla in the coming years will not only shake the world of electric cars but will also change the direction of the entire EV industry. For years, the shortage of lithium and its high prices had been a headache for Elon Musk. But now, it seems that Musk has found a solution, a battery that is cheaper, lighter, and more durable than lithium. But the story does not end here. The question is, will this aluminum-ion battery really be able to completely replace lithium? Is its charging speed and range the same as Elon Musk is claiming? And the biggest question, will this make Tesla's cars cheaper than before? If yes, then what will happen to the rest of the companies? After all, what is the world of EV going to be like after that? Before moving on to the video, subscribe to the channel so that you can be the first to hear the news of the biggest revolution in EVs. Before we dive into the futuristic battery technology of Tesla, let's take a look at the advanced battery technology that Tesla is using today. It's not just a car battery, it's a walking power station, with everything designed down to the micro level to make it travel longer, charge faster, and last for years with minimal maintenance. Today, Tesla uses two main types of batteries. One is lithium iron phosphate, LFP, batteries, and the other is nickel cobalt aluminum, NCA, batteries. LFP batteries are now being used exclusively in Tesla's cheaper cars like the Model 3 and Model Y, especially for the Chinese and Asian markets. The specialty of these batteries is that they are safer, can be charged more times, and have a longer life. Yes, they are a little heavier and have a little less range, but they are cheaper and safer. So Tesla uses them in cheaper models. On the other hand, NCA batteries, which Tesla has developed in collaboration with Panasonic, are more powerful. These are used in premium models such as Model S, Model X, and Cybertruck. These batteries have very high energy density, which means they can store more energy in less space, making it possible to travel longer distances but their maintenance and cooling are more sensitive. Now let's talk about Tesla's most advanced battery technology, the 4,680 cells. This battery is Elon Musk's latest game-changer innovation. Its size is hidden in the name itself, 46 mm wide and 80 mm long. These give many times more power than the old 2,170 cells, and their charging is also very fast. The most interesting thing is that these batteries also become part of the structure of Tesla's cars, that is, the battery is no longer just an inserted component. Now, it has become a part of the car, which has improved the strength, weight, and performance of the vehicle. To make these 4,680 batteries, Tesla has adopted a special dry electrode technology, which has made battery production even cheaper and faster. Tesla's own gigafactories are now making these batteries in large quantities, especially for the Model Y and Cybertruck. Elon Musk's dream is to make these batteries so cheaply that in the future, the cost of a car will be as much as that of a smartphone. Now that we have understood how advanced the battery system Tesla is using today, imagine when the same company is now moving toward future batteries like aluminum ion. What a big stir the entire auto industry is going to experience in the coming times. And this is the beginning, from where a new era of EV technology begins. How does the technology of aluminum ion battery work? Let us now talk about the technology that can completely change the world of EV in the coming times, aluminum ion battery. The name may seem like big science, but if understood in simple language, this battery is a system in which aluminum is being used in place of lithium, and that too with many benefits. When you turn on a device like a car, mobile, or laptop, these ions flow in one direction and electricity is generated from it. When you charge the battery, those ions again go in the opposite direction and fill their place. Now, in a lithium-ion battery, these ions are of lithium. But the problem is that lithium is a rare and expensive metal. Its mining harms the environment, and its supply is limited. This is why scientists found a new way. Why not take a metal that is abundant, light, cheap, and in which ions can move very fast? This is where the idea of aluminum-ion battery came from. Now let's know how aluminum ion battery works. In this battery, aluminum foil is used as the anode, i.e., the negative side. This is the same aluminum that you use as foil in the kitchen, 
but in a more pure and technical form. On the other hand, graphene is used for the cathode. It is a very thin but very strong carbon layer, which works like a superconductor, that is, ions can move very fast through it. When you charge this battery, the aluminum ions move from the anode to the graphene cathode. And when you discharge it, the same ions return to the anode, releasing energy. There is no dangerous reaction in this process, and most importantly, this whole process is very fast. Aluminum ion batteries charge up to 60 times faster than lithium ion. This means that if your lithium battery is fully charged in one hour, then the aluminum battery can be ready in just one to two minutes. In some prototypes, it has been seen that full charge is being obtained in just 90 seconds. This battery can be charged and discharged thousands of times. While a lithium battery lasts for 1,000 to 2,000 cycles, the aluminum ion battery can easily last for more than 10,000 cycles and without any risk of fire or explosion. Aluminum is abundant and easy to recycle. On the other hand, mining of lithium is expensive, limited, and dangerous. Because of this, aluminum batteries are safer and more sustainable for the environment. Aluminum is light, so the entire battery is lightweight. This increases the efficiency of the EV and also increases the range of the car. Also, it is cheaper in cost, as it neither uses expensive metals like cobalt nor does it require much processing. Aluminum ion batteries are more stable. Neither do they heat up too much nor are they prone to fire, whereas lithium batteries have been infamous for bursting or catching fire due to overheating. Now the question arises, if this is such a great technology, then why is it not available everywhere today? The answer is industrial-scale production. Aluminum ion batteries are yet to be manufactured on a large scale and fitted in EVs. Companies like Elon Musk's Tesla are working fast on this technology, but it will take some time for mass adoption. But it is certain that in the next two to three years, as soon technology, companies like China's BYD were also showing a steady increase in sales figures. For a time, it seemed that Tesla's grip might loosen. But then Tesla introduced its new carbon-wrapped motor, and the whole game changed. While traditional auto companies have been engaged in making electric versions of IC, internal combustion engine, cars till now, Tesla has been designing vehicles for EVs from the very beginning. Many of their vehicles are built on completely new platforms which are light, efficient, and capable of giving better performance. While old manufacturers are still making EVs from plants that were originally built for petrol and diesel vehicles, Tesla's plants have been designed for electric vehicles from the beginning. Not only that, where other companies rely on external suppliers for batteries and motors,